Hi guys, happy Monday. Um, it's time to share our pet expenses for the month of August. And it was quite high, higher than I wanted it to be, but that was due to Magnum having his gut issues and me having to take him to the vet. <laughs> and that coming to almost $400 in itself for the vet bill. Excuse me while I take a drink. I have a scratchy uh, throat, allergies, so I may have to take a sip of water here a couple times and I apologize if you hear my son screaming. He's playing video games and if any of you have teenage boys, you know when they get online and they start playing video games with their friends, they're obnoxious. Obnoxious and I can't stand it, but he's his room's in the basement which is right here and the stairway's here so you may hear somebody yelling in the background. No, I don't have anybody tied up in my basement. <laughs> it's just my son playing video games. Oh, geez. So, vet bills. Um, vet expenses was $588.63. And like I said, almost 400 of that was Magnum's gut issues he had this past month. And it was also Magnum having to get some vaccines and I had to buy heartworm for the boys and for kitten. So, yeah. More than I wanted to spend in vet bills this past month. Chewy.com, $72.60. Bully sticks, $107.89. Uh, I, had, I bought a new dog bed for the living room, $29.99. Um, they, if you hear them, they're wrestling over here in the kitchen too, in case you hear some noises, some weird noises. <laughs> my dogs, having five dogs, my dog beds do not last. The dog bed, because I always have a dog bed in the living room. They have dog beds in their crates, but they don't seem to tear them up as much as they do this one in the living room. Um, with five dogs constantly scratching at it and fluffing it, they're constantly ripping it. Um, this one I've only had like three weeks now, I think, and I've already had to sew two holes in it. So if you guys have a suggestion on a good indestructible, <laughs> which I don't think there's any such thing, an indestructible dog bed, please comment below and tell me where to find it because <laughs> I'm sick of buying dog beds. Um, I could make them. But the ones I make are even a little bit thinner, so they get they just get tore up really fast with five dogs. So I had to buy canned cat food that came to twenty-two dollars and sixty-four cents. Um, I bought new grain-free treats um, by Blue Dog Bakery. I bought three boxes, and it came to eleven dollars and ninety-seven cents. And they really like them, so I think I'm gonna stick with those for now, unless I find something um, better. I bought Bully Slices from PetSmart for $20.78. They really liked those too. Um, I bought Pork Chomps, uh, two bags that came to $13. And they really haven't been eating those like they used to. So I'm thinking I may um, stop buying those for a while and get them the Bully Slices that they seem to like. <coughs> Excuse me. Um... Also, Amazon, $12.88. Um, that was the extra from um, Judy, a subscriber, had sent me a $100 gift card for Amazon. And it came to $112.88. So the 12 dollars was extra for me to play. So I added that in here. And you know what? I bought greenies. The green free greenies and they're um, not on here so let me take a minute to add that into my total <laughs> I'll be right back so I totally forgot that I purchased the green a box of green free uh, greenies and they were $37.99 um, so I need to add that into my total so it's worse than I thought <laughs> So let me get a calculator and retotal this. Okay. So my grand.
grand total for August was $918.37. So I have to write that total on my envelope. So when I, because I'm going to add, I'm going to go all the way through October because I started sharing our expenses um, last year in October and I figured I'd go a whole year because when people ask me all the time how expensive is it to have um, five dogs, I can't really just tell them a monthly total because each month can be different. As you guys, if you've been watching these videos, you know. Each, each month is totally different depending on what comes up health-wise, um, vaccinations, all that kind of mess. So I figured I'd keep um, monthly totals for a year and then add them up. So, that, so we're going to do this through October of this year and then add it up and see. So I've got to change that amount so yeah so $918.37 let's pray let's cross our fingers guys that this month is better <laughs> let's pray let's pray everybody's good nobody has any problems the only problem that's been going on right now is and it's not even a problem Max has a teeny smaller than the end of this pen I noticed when I was grooming him um a little hot spot on the back of his right back leg the one that was affected from his spinal stroke and I've been um, using I'll have to do a video on that um, ivory soap you take I you take a original bar of ivory soap I'm just gonna tell you guys how to do it right here original bar of ivory soap and you suds it up and you just take the suds you don't take the bar of soap and you put the suds on the hot spot and then you sprinkle um, medicated gold bond powder on it and you do that every day you don't wash off the previous stuff you put on do that every day and that will dry and um, make that hot spot go away and it's been working it's scabbed up and it's shrunk um, it's almost gone so didn't have to take him to the vet the vet thank goodness for that um, because our dog ginger who we had before our schnauzers, she was a shepherd mix. She used to get hot spots as she, when she got older on her side. And my stepmom told me about this. She learned from um, a vet of hers on how to take care of them that way. So let's pray no problems this, this month. We are, what is today? Today's September 10th. So we're almost halfway through the month. No problems, knock on wood. <laughs> Okay, on to our emergency fund. What did we make for our YouTube, Amazon, and Patreon? For YouTube, which is really um, Google AdSense, it's the ads that play in my videos, we made $193.83. I need to get a drink here, guys. Um, our Amazon store, we made $33.29. Our Patreon page, we made $134.85. Uh, the total of all three of those is $361.97. So let me take you over to my little chart and show you how we did for our emergency fund. Okay, guys, remember my goal was $5,000. And in August, we hit over $5,000. $5,096.34. So I thank you guys so much for supporting our channel just by being subscribers, for shopping on our Amazon store, and for those of you who have pledged on our Patreon. I appreciate it so, so much. Now, if I would have done my chart right, like I said last month, this would all be filled in. But if you remember right, I thought it was going to take me till the end of the year to hit this goal. But thanks to all of you, we hit it in August. So what I'm going to do is just continually show you every month um, how much we make this year. And a couple people did... Um, a couple people did mention that I should really save more than... What's under there? Oh, it's a ball. <laughs> Um, I should really save more than 5,000, which I am. I'm not stopping at 5,000. Um, any money I make from YouTube or Patreon and Amazon is going into their, uh, emergency fund savings account. It does not get touched 
unless we have to touch it for medical reasons. Um, and then we tried to get it put right back as soon as possible, which thankfully we have not had to touch any of that money um, for the health issues that have come up since I started doing this. Um, I'm hoping this is for later on in their lives. Three of them are, um, Mozzie's going to be seven. So three of them are six right now. And uh, so they're getting middle-aged here soon. Um, so being a part of these Schnauzer groups on Facebook and talking to you guys, things usually do come up later in the later years of Schnauzers and I want to be prepared so I'm not scrambling um, to figure out how I'm going to care for my dogs. So, so anyways, yes, I will be continually adding all the money I make on YouTube to the dog's um, emergency fund. Why do you keep putting the ball under there? <laughs> Why do you keep putting the ball under there? <laughs> Are you trying to get it too? I think they like to try to, I think they put it under there on purpose so they can try to get it. I don't know. <laughs> okay, hold on. Let me help these guys out. Where is it? Let me see if I can, um, let's see if I can push the, oh, <laughs> did you get it? Yay! Whoa. Good job, Mickey. Good job. <laughs> okay, guys, if you guys have any uh, questions about our emergency fund or anything about the boys, just put them below and I'll try to answer them on a future video. Okay, we'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.